All right, this is video of the bruising kit. I have the 3.7 volt LG cells, 2.2 amp hour, so 2200 milliamp hours. These are, there are 100 in here all wired in parallel. I'm at 3.68 volts. I'm gonna do a load test, but I'm also gonna show amperage draw just because, you know, this might not be as accurate. I wanna show real world numbers. But basically I'm building, I have three more of these. I'm building a 12 volt bank. Well, technically, I'm going to be charging at 16.2 volts with my Maxwell caps. Basically, what I'm trying to do is just show you know you can make a do it yourself reserve in a car audio um, car audio ah shit what's the word y'all in a car audio application I guess or in the field. But you know I'm just going to point out some things. You know make sure you. You know, you might have to hammer these things together and, you know, put them in, you know, two rows of 10 is the big as I'll make it. But I'll make sure I'll hammer on these stud parts right here to get a better connection. But uh, another thing, too, it's really hard to put um, four bus bars per thread because the threads aren't long enough. So that's why, you know, they're not completely paralleled in like a ladder shape. Man. But each row is connected to another row. I'm going to go ahead and make a video real quick. I'm going to load test and I'm going to show you all the amperage draw. Hey, thanks for watching. Check out the Drawing 20 amps. I mean, if you notice that, it's not even dropping. It's only 20 amps, but yeah. I'm holding it for a long time. I'll let go of it. <laughs> yep. 200 amp hour, 3.7 volt. Um bank and uh, I, like I said I have three more of these and I'll have more videos update y'all on how they play out